Just recently, the 10th ranked Duke University Blue Devils visited Farmville for a matchup with the field hockey team, where that day, the final score was less important than the image Longwood wants to portray to athletic conferences looking to add to their numbers. Athletics Director Troy Austin remains optimistic that all Lancer sports will have a home soon and that playing big-name schools like Duke will only raise the university's profile. I think the biggest impact comes with regards to student athletes and recruiting. Uh, because honestly, everybody wants, as a, as a competitor, you want to play the best, you want to have a chance at beating the best. Longwood University continues its search for conference affiliation. Many Longwood Lancer sports teams have had the luck of scheduling big name opponents both at home and on the road. And here to talk with me right now, the sports editor of the Rotunda, Ben Maitland. And of course, Longwood recently had the Duke University Blue Devils visit the athletics complex in a women's field hockey match. They also uh, had a chance to go on the road to take on another ACC foe in Wake Forest. A lot of big names coming to Longwood, a lot of road games as well. As Longwood continues to search for a conference, uh, how big of an impact do you think it is to play these top tier teams? Uh, it's a big impact, Keenan, in that, you know, it gives us the exposure. Um, you know, you, you mentioned playing Duke uh, in field hockey and um, Wake Forest in field hockey, and it does give us the exposure. And, you know, I only see good things coming from them down the road, you know, as we hit into the basketball season, baseball, softball, um, and all those sports as we uh, hit the fall months and the spring months next year. On tap this fall for Lancer Athletics are contests with the University of North Carolina and the University of Virginia in field hockey, matches featuring Virginia Tech and Navy for men's soccer, and a trip to Happy Valley for the women's golf team in the Penn State Nittany Lion Invitational. In the end, Longwood's competition on the field may help them off the field as they look to gain much-needed recognition in their continued search for a conference home. Reporting for the Rotunda Show, I'm Keenan Crump. Again, your final score.